Connection. Aloha, everybody. Welcome to Maui, Karen Ann. Thank you for taking time out of your busy, busy schedule to view my paintings. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please do. You hit subscribed, then you hit the bell, and then you hit all, and every time, it looks like I'm praying, doesn't it? Every time I put a video on YouTube, you'll be notified. She's praying you guys would watch. Yes, and give me comments. I can't get anybody to give me comments. It's almost depressing. So anyway, this is the painting I did the other day. I wanted to do gray and yellow. So what I did was, if you go to Pinterest and put in yellow color platelet or palette, whatever, they will give you all kinds of colors that go with yellow. So this is where I picked this out, was from Pinterest. So I did the yellow on this side, the gray on this side, and then they had some blues and purples and stuff, so I mixed all that together. This came out okay. It's not my favorite, but if you look down here in this corner, you can really see the contrast between the gray and yellow, and I like that. So, people, if any of you have gray in your house, you can use yellow to accent it. And I think that's very pretty, especially for this time of year, for spring. So, that's that. It's all dry. I will probably resin it in the future, okay, as soon as it dries enough. Now, today, I just wanted to go over a few basics with you. This is a 16 by 20 canvas. I have leveled it each way. I've got push pins and I've got tape. This is the tape I use. I get it at the dollar store. So if you want to save some money, here it is. And it's got 17 and a half yards of tape. So it does last. I mean, for a buck, you can't go wrong. Then another thing I wanted to show you is my friend Cheryl gave me this. What this is, is you put this on your flow trawl. Or your salt shaker. Or your salt shaker, pepper shaker. I don't know. It must be a big shaker if it fits this. So <laughs> anyway, you put this on your flow trawl before you pour, and then this catches all the gunk so you don't have any gunk in your flow trawl. Now I'm going to tell you, I use three ounces of flow trawl, one ounce of paint, and then water to the consistency I want. I can't give you an exact um, percentage of water because every paint is different. If you use metallic, metallic paint requires more water. So it's something that you learn as you mix paint. You'll know when you've got enough. I want to give a couple of shout outs today. To, one is to B.R. Turner who is so creative, can't believe it, just so impressed. Then I want to give a shout out to Madison Kane for watching and subscribing, and for Zen Art, that's Z-E-N-A-R. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Today, this is what we're doing. This is a suggestion from my director extraordinaire, Okay, so what I'm doing today is we're going to do half the canvas black and half red. So this is Deco Art Black, and this is Artist Loft Deep Red. So I've mixed them. 
so that they're, let me use maybe the red, you can see. It's real runny. So what you want, when you lift up your little popsicle stick here, thingy-majiggy, you want it to absolutely disappear into the water that's, or into your paint that's down there. You want to add enough water that that happens. So this is Aqua by um, Artist Loft, and I'm using this, but as you can see, it puddles a little bit. You can see a little puddle on top. So that's the thickness that you want when you're going to do a Dutch pour. At least that's what I like. So we're going to do red and black. I'm going to be using Folk Art Wine Berry. I've got my own gray mix. And I want you to notice that the lids, I have cleaned the lids because I'm finding that I get, if I haven't used the bottle in a while, the paint dries in here. And then when I go to use it, it gets kind of gunky. So anyway, and also this is the Artist Loft turquoise I'm using. And we've got Folk Art Metallic Gold. And I guess that's it. So I will be still and try to try to make a gorgeous painting for us all to enjoy. And my director, Cocktail Tony, which if you haven't watched, you should watch his uh, videos. He has two a week. And subscribe. He needs subscribers. We both need subscribers. So tell your friends and neighbors, and even people you don't like, tell them to subscribe. We need subscribers, and I need comments. Cocktail Tony gets comments. I get four. Okay, let's have some music. Antonio.
That black came out beautiful. Woohoo! It looks good. It looks good. Yay, 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 yay. Oh my gosh. I love it, I love it, I love it. It's absolutely fantastic. Would you look at these colors and look at the gold, all the cells in there. The colors came out great. I did use uh, my own mix of gray. And so that is in the black, so that's why it looks like it does. Um, wowzers! Woohoo! I'm going to use Jilly's, uh, Jilly from Australia. She says wowzer a lot. Man, is this a wowzer painting or what? And look at the red side. Look at the gold. Look at how this came out. Man, oh man. Woohoo! I don't know, folks. This is gorgeous. When this dries, I will resin it. And this is going to be spectacular. Oh, I'm so happy, happy, happy. Oh, the colors are great. So anyway, I'll try to bring myself back to earth. What I'm going to do now is you have to go along and wipe the sides like this because your paint will continue to move. And now that I've got this beautiful, beautiful painting, I don't want it to change. I want it to stay. Look at these cells up here, these gold. Oh my gosh, and over here, there's a little bit of red. Maybe I should have had more red in there. I don't know. Over here, I had the uh, folk art um, wine berry, and so that came out looking great. I could have maybe used a little bit more red. Maybe I was being too cautious. And then over here I've got red, but when it mixed with the gray, it kind of made it a pinkish color. That's okay. It still looks good. Oh my gosh, and the aqua, I love the aqua. Yay! Yay for Team Maui Karen Ann. What about Cocktail Tony? And Cocktail Tony, too, absolutely. Don't forget, wear a mask. Social so, anyway, <laughs> I will keep my eye on this as I clean up. I will list the paints underneath the video. And please, please make a comment. You like it, you hate it, you wish I would have used different colors. You want me to shut up? You want me to shut up, as <laughs> Cocktail Tony just said. <laughs> I guess he hears me talking too much. I'm going to quit and tell you I hope you're healthy and well. I hope everything in your life is good. Think positive. And whatever you do, be kind to one another, love one another, and from Hawaii we say mahalo and aloha.